Okay, YouTube, I'm back. So, um, I have a really um, nice herb uh, that has a lot of good properties, and I just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, I love cinnamon. Cinnamon just it has a lot of rich properties, a lot of sweet with rich properties, sweet and rich properties. What I like about um, you can, what I like about cinnamon is that you can do it as an infusion or you can do it as a tea. And I went over this in a private class. I had a private class group um, for a family and I was going over some of the properties and what I have been noticing is that cinnamon is great for Crohn's disease it's great for you can you can do it as an infusion or you can do it as a cinnamon water and the way that you do it as a infusion or cinnamon water <clears throat> well cinnamon water you probably want to get about I would say um, three cinnamon sticks and you want to soak them in some distilled water uh, like a gallon of distilled water put it on top of the fridge and leave it overnight and then in the morning you have cinnamon water you can add a little ajave or something like that to it or some stevia or some maple syrup i like maple syrup and it can be like a cinnamon drink it's good for the kids it's good for the whole family the benefits that I found out from cinnamon, uh, like number one, I said Crohn's disease. Um, it's great also for your skin, acne, and it's also a reinforcement to the immune system because it's an antiviral, an antimicrobial, and an antifungus. It's also great for your joints, your pains, flu, colds. Um, it's great for information. It's great for candidates, fungus. Your blood circulation is really good for that. It's good for your heart. And what it does for your heart, it lowers the, it reduces the uh, LDL, um, which we know that that is the bad cholesterol for us. So it reduces the LDL. It's great for diabetes. It also acts the same as insulin does but without but without a lot of side effects but give you all of those other great benefits it's good for weight loss when you do the cinnamon water and you leave it overnight it actually eats up the fat when you start using it as cinnamon water so i just want to tell you guys some great properties that uh, cinnamon does and go and do some research yourself because it actually does a lot more than what I've just told you. I've given you probably about 15 different regimens. Also with cinnamon, if you have like teenagers with a lot of acne that's inflamed, you know, like with the big puffs, bumps in their face, you can make cinnamon out of a paste. And you can just take it on your finger and just do this over the acne and it, it, it'll start, what it's going to start doing is going to start pulling all of the pus and the toxins out of the child's skin and it's going to make the swelling go down but we still have to change the diet of the teenager because really there's no such thing as um well you you're going through puberty and your skin is inflamed my son has not had any inflamed skin and he'll be 16 he very seldom get a pus bump very 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 seldom when he does get one it lets me know that he has eaten something that he was not supposed to have uh but he has he, he his skin has always been beautiful as a teenager he did not go through that what they tell us that it's puberty when they should tell us that it's just a bad diet for the teenager so anytime we see teenagers with a, a lot of pus bumps in their face it simply means that their diet is bad. Their diet is toxic. They have a lot of uh, processed foods, not enough water, uh, the wrong water. So that's usually what that means. 
Uh, some people have asked me before, well, why isn't your skin clear? Well, the thing about it, I have never, I have never had acne. I have scarring from having the chicken pox as a child. But, um, so that's about all I want to say today. I'll come back later on tonight and give another uh, herb of the day. I, I'm trying to do as many YouTubes as I possibly can. So I'm trying to do like maybe five, six, seven, maybe ten a day. But it takes time because I also have orders that I have to do. So, um, I need you guys' support because I want to start going live on YouTube. But I need 1,000 subscribers. So, you can help me by subscribing to this channel. And like, kind, like, comment, share, and all of that stuff. Okay? Talk to you guys later.